And America's FDA has given the go-ahead for Neuralink Tech to have human trials. Uh, we put a, a chip in your brain to control your mind. Yeah. Neuralink has taken a significant step forward in its development process. This year, 2023, seems to be exciting for Elon Musk, with SpaceX launching Starship into orbit and Tesla unveiling Cybertruck. Amidst all these achievements, Neuralink has received approval in the United States to begin conducting trials on human subjects. This milestone is a reason for Musk to be even more delighted as it brings us closer to a technology that has the potential to transform the way people think. However, before we begin our video, we would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe to our YouTube channel and also press the bell icon. Now let's get started. In its initial development stages, Neuralink primarily focused on addressing brain injuries, so there's no need to worry about it unexpectedly emerging. This accomplishment has been a long time in the making, and now the moment has finally arrived. After keeping their chip's progress under wraps for a few months, Neuralink recently caused a stir on Twitter with a tweet announcing their FDA approval for launching their first clinical study involving human participants. This remarkable achievement is the result of the dedicated work of the Neuralink team, working closely with the FDA. It marks an important initial step towards a future where our technology can benefit numerous individuals. First and foremost, congratulations to the Neuralink team for this incredible milestone. Obtaining FDA approval for a technology like Neuralink is no easy task, and many companies have either faced rejections or struggled for years without success. Placing a brain chip is a delicate procedure, and ensuring that it does more good than harm is essential. The size of the chip or implant is currently similar to that of a coin, as demonstrated by Musk. However, it is possible that the size will significantly decrease in the future to facilitate easier implantation. During implantation, a small section of the skull will be carefully removed to create space for the chip. A highly precise surgical robot will then connect thousands of minuscule threads, nearly invisible from the coin, to specific neurons in the brain. To provide some perspective, each thread is approximately one-fourth the diameter of a single strand of human hair. These threads are incredibly tiny, leaving no room for error during the procedure. This is why the task must be performed by a robot rather than a human. Even the most skilled surgeons may not possess the same accuracy and precision as a robot. The surgical robot utilized by Neuralink was specifically designed for this purpose, ensuring utmost precision throughout the procedure. The surgical robot used by Neuralink is equipped with multiple high-precision cameras and employs advanced imaging techniques to detect the brain's position, ensuring that the insertion of threads does not affect blood vessels. Once the chip is successfully implanted, it establishes a connection with a computer, enabling the patient to control computer interfaces using their thoughts. Although in a couple of years the chip may become more widely available, Musk's primary focus for Neuralink is to address various brain-related problems in neurological conditions like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. Now, one might wonder about the effectiveness of such a complex device. It's important to note that Neuralink or Elon Musk did not develop the technology behind this brain-computer interface or BCI chip. BCI studies have been conducted for decades, and Neuralink's contribution has pushed the boundaries of this technology beyond what was previously thought possible around 10 or 15 years ago. Neuralink didn't have to start from scratch in developing the chip, benefiting from the existing knowledge and advancements in brain-computer interface technology. At its current stage of development, the chip has shown some success. You may already be familiar with the monkey that could play mind pong after undergoing tests with the Neuralink system. Additionally, Neuralink successfully implanted the chip in a pig back in 2020. During this time, the system recorded various neural activities such as when the pig was given food or walked on a treadmill. However, achieving this success was not without its challenges and criticisms. Neuralink holds itself to higher standards than what the FDA requires for device implantation, similar to how Tesla maintains higher safety standards than those mandated by the US government. Despite these high standards, some employees within the company are not entirely satisfied with the methods employed to reach their current position. There were failed surgeries on monkeys, sheep, and pigs in the pursuit of obtaining FDA approval as quickly as possible. While these animal experiments yielded the desired data, they resulted in unnecessary animal deaths throughout the process, which could have been avoided. It is important to consider Neuralink's perspective on the matter as well. 
While it is true that animals were unfortunately lost during the experiments, Neuralink maintains that it was not due to animal cruelty. In research involving animals, unforeseen events can occur even when conducted ethically and with the utmost care. Certain factors cannot always be completely ruled out during these experiments. According to Neuralink, extensive planning and careful consideration were undertaken before any animals were involved. The company made every effort to ensure the well-being of the animals tested and adhered to established guidelines. Although the allegations are being investigated, the fact that the FDA has provided approval suggests that there may be truth to Neuralink's assertions and that the animal tests are deemed reliable enough to proceed with. It is worth noting that the FDA had previously denied Neuralink's approval on multiple occasions due to specific deficiencies. In fact, they also denied the company earlier this year. If there were significant issues with the technology at this stage, the FDA would not hesitate to halt its progress once again. However, as Neuralink is moving forward with human trials, it indicates that the FDA has found the technology promising. This places a substantial responsibility on Neuralink as they continue their work. The concept of our digital presence continuing after death raises intriguing questions about the role of technology in our lives. Text messages, social media posts, and emails remain online even when someone passes away, creating a digital ghost. This perspective highlights the interconnectedness between ourselves and computers. Elon Musk sees Neuralink as a means to expand our connection with technology further. Currently, there are already 42 individuals worldwide who have undergone brain chip implantation. While many companies primarily focus on brain implants for medical purposes, Neuralink aims for something more ambitious and currently considered impossible. This is what makes the upcoming stage of development so significant. The Neuralink device goes beyond assisting patients in controlling robotic arms or aiding in rehabilitation. It seeks to enhance and potentially surpass normal brain capabilities. In a tweet earlier in April, Musk expressed the goal of surpassing the performance of non-disabled individuals, allowing people to merge their minds with machines seamlessly. Imagine the incredible ability to comprehend someone speaking a different language instantly. It's a remarkable concept to consider. According to Musk, many people are already somewhat cyborgs due to our heavy reliance on smartphones in today's society. Smartphones and other digital devices have revolutionized the way we access information and data that would otherwise be inaccessible. However, there is still a significant gap in the speed at which information flows between our biological selves and the digital world. Neuralink aims to bridge this gap and facilitate a seamless connection. It's important to note that there is still a considerable amount of work to be done before this vision can become a reality. We're looking at a time frame of around a decade or possibly even longer before such advancements can be fully realized. The potential impact is enormous if Neuralink and Elon Musk can accomplish their goals. It could greatly benefit individuals with neurological conditions while enabling people to compete with the ever advancing field of artificial intelligence actively. In fact, it may even reach a point where you can enhance your abilities and potentially upload your subconscious mind into a machine offering a form of immortality in a sense. This might bring to mind fictional characters like Arnim Zola from The Avengers or Will from the movie Transcendence, where the boundaries of human consciousness and technology are explored. The possibilities truly seem boundless. Nevertheless, let's return to the present reality. Neuralink is not currently accepting patient applications and has not disclosed detailed information regarding the process. The initial plan was to involve 10 patients in the first round of testing. However, Due to ongoing challenges, this number may be reduced for the time being. The year 2023 holds promise for intriguing developments and observing Neuralink's future actions and progress will be captivating. That's it for today. We hope you found our video interesting. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with others. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new uploads. In the end, Thanks for watching and see you next time.